Alright, hey guys, it's Goku here, and today we're going to be playing some GTA 5 Online. I'm going to be showing you how to make a lot of money real fast, solo. Hey. Screw off, Lester. But anyway, as I was saying beforehand, the other thing you will need to do is have, yeah, need to have an arena, and you need to have a car that is, has all upgrades for this. That's what you need mainly. So, I would recommend uh, Elegy and upgrade it at Benny's. You also need an arena workshop with uh, Benny's workshop with it. And one. So from there, what you have to do is join anyone you want to. It doesn't really matter who, just as long as they're not in the session. Join anyone. And then when it says, are you sure you want to? You press B at first. But as you see in the video, once I enter, you wait until you, the, uh, you, see, a cir wait until you see a circle on its own with no loading. Like there, right there. Then you try and join that person again. And this time, you, you accept it. Now what should happen is you probably should see water in the background. If you see the arena in the background, it most likely has not worked. And the load screen is going to take a long time, because this, this does take a while because you're doing the glitch. There's a chance this might not work because it will say error or activity or something like that. But 98% of the time it will work. And this is a card duplication glitch. I recommend you sell between 45 minutes an hour. Each time. Unless it's in the morning. Alright, I'm going to cut this out and show you after loading screen. Alright, so once you load, you should be under the map. Now remember, do not call any cars of your own. If there's a car outside the arena workshop, you can put it in, but you cannot call it. But if there's no cars, it doesn't matter. Just walk in there then. So, yeah. Anyway. You also need an office, by the way. Like an office garage, a CEO business, basically. So you can put the car in there. Because you can't customise the car at the start once you do but. Anyway, so see the ramp, most of the time you have no vehicle right next to you, your own vehicle. Because you cannot call it, but you can go in it if it's right there. Or if a car is right there, you can put it in. I normally, I also use this, I would normally, well yeah, English, please. Sorry, I've not spoken a while in video. Um, for the car, you can literally, if it's a car you want to get rid of and you don't want to sell it, so you don't have that daily sell limit. I suggest that this is the chance to do it. So now we gotta drive to the arena workshop. And as we get there, I'll talk uh, normally, I guess, while we get there. It's been a while since I've done a glitch video, so I guess I just decided to upload one. There's always been normal videos, and you know, some people like that, some people don't. Some people actually like me just showcasing I cracked them free. If there wasn't a glitch, but it's level up really fast, and Lester again. God damn, Lester's annoying. Anyway, once you get to the arena, now either walk in there if there's no car that's yours, or drive in there. It does not affect the glitch. Just make sure that you actually join that session, because if you join that set, if you do not, then this glitch is not going to work. If you join a job, oh yeah, okay, I'm just skipping a step. All right, so excuse me, guys, sorry about that. I'm just gonna put that car in there because it's a car I want to get rid of. I don't want to sell for about well, five grand or less. <laughs> it was. Because the car I thought was cool, and then eventually I just realized it was. I, oh, yeah, it was for a roleplay. I forgot about that. Whoops. Alright, so once you've done that, you have to go. Well, uh, back in the car. Any car um, that you do not mind losing. So I recommend just getting allergies or any car you just don't want anymore. So once you just drive here, and it should disappear. After that, go to the blue circle. Once you're in the blue circle, put your allergy custom to where the other car was. Now your copy should be the one where you've not driven it. You, sh you can tell the which one was driven. See the one that's been moved to that location is the real one. The one that's been duped is the one that's still in the same place. But you can easily tell. So anyway, once you do that, you got to activate a quick job and then leave the arena. Otherwise it won't work. Otherwise you can exit. And now, after that, what you do is you simply just cancel that quick job. I recommend go to shooting range because it's no one does shooting range. I mean, come on. Um, and then go to your CEO office. And the reason why, oh yeah, if you, if you do join a game like in a bad time, I've had that happen to me. Um, the glitch still works. It's just your drive is a lot longer. Excuse me. The reason why you need these cars is because the glitch gets rid of the original price of a car, but it sells the upgrades. 
So this has got upgraded to an LG Custom or an Electro, whatever you want to call it. And now it's 950k or something like that near there. Either way, it's near a million dollars. So once you go into your office, what you gotta do is modify your vehicle. And once you modify, I know you change the windows, like from the normal one back to the fancy one. So five hundred dollars. So come on, pretty cheap. Maybe cheaper rain spray, but it's just a lot quicker as well. The reason why you want to switch something so it saves, because the chance that the car might change back to its original self, the crap car that you want to get rid of. Or the LG. So it kicks you out, you go back in, then you modify the car. So it just saves it. The reason why you also need the office, by the way, is because without it, you cannot sell the car. The game does not allow you to sell it because it's glitched. So you just gotta make sure you gotta kinda fix it so you can sell the car again. Bada bing bada boom, now you can just exit the office garage. And that should be you. Boom, that's all you need. <laughs> if you need any help, my gamer tag is Juggernaut Armor. And, or, you can just comment below what you're stuck with and I can, well, reply to you. Hope you guys have a good day everyone, and peace out.